Have you ever wondered what it's like to be a veteran on Veterans Day? Well, I'm here to show you. First, let's we'll start with the haircut so I look good today. Can't be dealing with this crap anymore. It's free, by the way. All right, that's better. Time to go get some breakfast. Now, shoot, I could just walk right across the street here to IHOP, but I'm more of a waffle man myself. So the trick when you do this is to order water because the coffee is like four bucks. So if you want a free meal, you gotta be drinking water. Which is good because I don't drink enough water as it is, right? Ah, oh, that was delicious. Now usually I'd go straight over to Wendy's and get that free breakfast, but I've got to come home because I've got someone looking at the chimney. This thing is a disaster. And I probably got to get it fully replaced. I'm going to find out and then hopefully this will be quick and then I'll get back out there. I saw Wendy out here. I hope uh, this comes out okay. Anyway, they're going to be a few minutes. I'm going to walk down that Little Caesars and get a free lunch comp. Every year on Veterans Day I do this little challenge to see how many places I can go to in this, in this day to get as much free food as I can. I don't know why. It's like kind of like my Thanksgiving, I guess. Oh, I got that cocaine coffee. I wanted to do it in there, but I felt, I found myself uh, trying to talk in a different tone, like, oh, I'm not gonna even repeat it. I am never gonna understand why people wait in a 30 minute line for that coffee. I understand it's good coffee, but damn people. Hello, I'm David and I'm a Cheddar Bay holic. As much as I love free food, every year I go place to place as fast as I can on this day, getting as much as I can. Kind of like Pokemon, gotta catch them all, I guess. I don't know, it's quite the addiction. It grows and grows every year. Uh, but that's not what this day is about. I mean, that's the way I take things for being a veteran. But what I tend to forget to do myself is actually thank a veteran. Uh, because there's plenty of other veterans out there and there's some as you see here that's given the ultimate sacrifice and even I find myself taking for granted the rights and freedoms that we have in this country and I forget we even have a military sometimes it's quite crazy how like you can get in your own little world but just get out there today, thank a veteran somehow, even if you don't know one or don't want to say thank you physically, literally, then just come to a place like this and maybe get a different perspective. Because every time I come to one like this, it's just hard to believe how many people have actually died for this country. For me to be standing here doing what I do every day. And most of the time, I don't even think about it. As sad as that might sound. So get out there today, thank a veteran in some way, shape or form. Uh, they, they do deserve it. And I want to say thank you for watching. And I also want to say thank you to any veteran out there that is watching. Because I've been forgetting to do that myself. So thank you. Have a great day.